हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल मैथमेटिक शॉर्टकट्स ये वन स्टॉप फॉर लर्निंग ऑल द मैथमेटिक शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स व्हिच आर रिक्वायर्ड टू क्रैक ऑल दोस क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड एग्जामिनेशन एंड फॉर स्कूल स्टूडेंट्स इट्स अ बून यू नो इन द पैंडमिक सिचुएशन वेन द स्टूडेंट्स आर एट होम दे नीड टू अपस्किल दम दे कैन लर्न न्यू ट्रिक्स ऑफ कैलकुलेटिंग टेन टाइम्स फास्टर and uh, obviously when they appear in uh, all those quantitative aptitude competitive exams later on in their lives they will be cracking these multiple choice questions very easily by watching all these videos which i am posting so what do we have in this video i think you must have heard of magic squares right so i am going to take up the concept of 4 by 4 magic square i'll tell you uh, what what's a magic square what is the logic behind uh, you know uh, framing of a magic square uh, the sum of the rows and the uh, columns what uh, it can be and how to construct such a magic square i am talking of a 4 by 4 magic square in this video so we'll learn to draw this magic square in just about 10 seconds you can draw this okay so talking of all these magic tricks and short uh, short tricks for calculating 10 times faster i keep on uh, telling to my subscribers you know uh, this is the ebook exclusive ebook uh, you will not find this kind of a uh, collection of short tricks for quantitative aptitude anywhere on the internet or in the print form also so this is an exclusive ebook my own work of uh, about uh, so many years you know and uh, it's neatly typed now and uh, over 350 short tricks in 333 pages it's it's a huge uh, uh, collection of uh, short tricks so you all can procure a copy of this a very very nominal cost associated with the book it's not a free book so uh, if you are willing to spend a little bit on your education only then you can use uh, my whatsapp number and send me a message on that 9896369963 that's the number so go for it and let's see now what is this method which i'm going to discuss uh, in this video is this is known as the mirror swapping uh, method and mirror swapping method is basically you know you uh, have um, the concept of mirror images there so you you must be uh, already uh, having a little idea about what is this swapping all about okay so now let's carry on with the method and let's show you how you can actually get to the 4 by 4 magic square you all know that magic square is a, a matrix of numbers in which all the rows all the columns if you add all the numbers in a row or all the numbers in a column or all the numbers along the diagonal you get the same answer right so i'll tell you the what is the simplest magic square and how you can actually make that magic square yourself so all the students watching this just watch now the first thing is see this is a 4 by 4 magic square right so what will be the sum of the numbers in the row or in the column or along the diagonal the sum of the numbers will be there is a formula for that a very very easy formula k times k square plus 1 upon 2 this will be the sum of the numbers along along a row or along a column or along the diagonal if we are talking of 4 by 4 magic square then k is 4 so if you substitute k equal to 4 here 4 times 4 square 16 plus 1 17 upon 2 68 upon 2 this is 34 so now the sum of the four numbers which you are going to get is 34 let's see how on the left hand side you can see here i have drawn a simple matrix of 16 numbers in order 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 we need to make minor changes in this matrix in order to get our magic square the first thing is the first row the middle two numbers that is 2 and 3 they will not be changed likewise the first column the middle two numbers 5 and 9 they will not be changed their position remains the same likewise the last row 14 and 15 they will also remain at their own positions and the last column 8 and 12 they will also remain there so you don't have to change eight of the numbers they will be where they are 
the rest is all about mirror swapping if you consider that the diagonal of this matrix suppose this is this is the diagonal which i am drawing now this is just for reference if you consider that this is the mirror where will the image of one this is one here where will the image of one go it will go to 16 so we will swap one and 16 so let's write 16 here and one here likewise if you see the position of the number six the number six here and the number 11 here obviously they will be interchanging their positions if we have a mirror in between so let's swap their positions this will be 11 and this will be 6 likewise if you have the other diagonal as the mirror then 7 and 10 these will be swapping their positions and 4 and 13 they will also be swapping their positions so let's swap their positions also 13 goes in place of 4 so here comes 4 and 13 goes here and then we have 7 and 10 changing their position 7 comes here and 10 comes here now friends that's it we have completed our magic square can you just check what is the sum of all the numbers along this row like this 16 plus 2 18 18 and 3 21 plus 13 34 the same number which i got through the formula check all the rows check all the columns check all the diagonals you are going to get 34 now there are some more patterns which will get you the number 34 in this particular pattern in this particular magic square can you see pick up any square in that see this is a square right check the sum of these four numbers 6 plus 12 is 18 18 plus 15 is 33 plus 1 is 34 pick up any square you are going to get 34 as the sum of those four numbers so the, there is a question for you now the question is if you have that magic square which i have just shown you how many how many possible possible groups of four numbers groups of four numbers will add up to 34 will add up to 34 just check in the mag magic square which i just showed you and you will tell me in my in the comments uh, below that how many possible groups of four numbers will add up to 34 just check the rows check the columns check the diagonals check four numbers together that is it can be together they can be they can be uh, they have to be forming a square okay so i've given you a hint they have to be forming a square right so check whether they are getting a sum of 34 or not and if yes do tell me how many possible combinations are there and in my next video i am coming up with another very important concept of how to draw a six by six magic square that video is going to be an amazing one so you can just wait for that video i'll be there with that video explanatory video what will be the sum you already know that right k times k square plus one upon two i told you the formula so wait for that video and do share this video with all your friends who are uh, interested in such interesting uh, things uh, you know in mathematics and i hope you have subscribed the channel by now and click the bell shaped icon for getting all the notifications of this channel and uh, a really important thing is that you click that all notifications tab in the bell shaped icon so that uh, you don't miss out on any live stream or any uploads which i might be doing in future or uh, you know uh, all those puzzles and uh, short tricks also thanks for watching this video friends